the mural, it has a purpose. I understand that when the new art building was being built, they actually came across some native Kumeyaay bones. And so the mural is basically an honoring of the people who lived here before. And I'm from the Santa Isabel Kumeyaay, Ipai Nation of Santa Isabel. This is actually the second public artwork I've done to honor the Kumeyaay. I felt like, you know, I was representing a nation and am I doing something that they would feel connected with? Since probably I was 12 years old, I've always been fascinated by rock art. And it wasn't until this mural did I realize that there is such an incredible collection of Kumeyaay rock art. And they did that, so why don't I, you know, put it up on the wall so you're actually seeing very specifically what kinds of designs they did. I've worked as an artist all my life, and art to me is spiritual. Making it and then seeing a person receive it. And in about 2014, I was kind of running up against some bumps, and I've always wanted to keep my art fresh. So I thought about a class, and City College is the closest to my home. But what was great was that it really just brought me out of that slump. When Terry asked me initially if I would do this mural, quite frankly, I'm getting older and I'm just not as flexible as I used to be. And I was real concerned and she said, oh no, 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 you don't have to paint. You can be as involved as you want. So actually City College students of hers are the ones who painted this. I paint in layers. So as you look at the design, you'll see that one image kind of lays over the other one. And when I was getting ready to paint, I was thinking, ooh, how's this gonna be for somebody who's not familiar with this kind of painting? So it ended up coming out as about six layers. And originally they were gonna hand draw the images and then paint them in. But they actually tried to project the image onto the wall and painting while the image was up. Terry said it was like paint by number. It was wonderful, it was so easy. And I looked at it and I was just stunned at how exact it was. They've done such an incredible job. What this really represents is the cosmos, the underworld and then the world where we live and the stars and the universe. I couldn't think of anything more personal than showing people the artwork of my people from the spirit. So it's a way of kind of just letting people subtly know that you know there were people who lived here before. Thousands and thousands of years they've been here and thousands and thousands of years they've been creating art. So it was a way of honoring the elders and the ancestors.